Hello everyone, it's Brookie again. Thanks for tuning into my channel. Um, so it's Friday. I ain't got no job. Just kidding. Um, <laughs> so I have a special guest. This is my best friend, Brittany P. Brittany Perkins. Brittany Najee Julia Perkins. Brit Bang Bang 2020 is in the building, and this is my alcoholic friend. And I think it's very important for everyone to have an alcoholic friend. Um, you need someone who will drink with you or even drink with others when you don't want to. You know, Brittany's always been there for me. She showed up to every little family get together and she's inviting me to half of hers. So like she just we're just like in the family together, you know? Yeah. So Brittany, yes. what are we doing today? We are tasting black owned businesses and their wines. Yes. Yes, we are. Okay, we got the Earl Stevens Mango Scotto, the 19 Crimes Cali Red, the Earl Stevens Sweet Red Wine, and the McBride Sisters Black Girl Magic Rosé. Amen. Amen to the lineup, all these black-owned businesses. We kind of already started, and it's okay, though. So we're just going to start. We're going to jump right in, and this is the Earl Stevens Mango Scotto. And uh, let's pray I can get this cork out real quick. I hope so. I never put it in that tight. There you go. Okay. Just a little. Okay. Okay. Well, let's see. Uh, let's toast. Toast to women empowerment. Did I say that right? I think yeah, women empowerment. And look, this this glass has empowered women on there. Did you do that on purpose? Yes, I did. I didn't even know. <laughs> wow. Yes. What an occasion. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. This is very not mangoey. I will say that it is definitely uh, a liquor taste you taste the liquor that's why it's 18 percent um i don't taste no mango that's very warm to the chest like hennessy i'm gonna take it as that how about you it smells like mango it's not a very strong mango taste um but i don't like mango so it's not that bad for me i'll drink it but it's not like my first choice um it just feels like something that you could easily sip that will catch up to you and will have you like really feeling the shits. All the shits. Ooh. Ooh, felt that in my chest. This I, is. Yeah, I felt it. All right. Mm. Let's go. Um, We're playing a game. Don't forget. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So I bought this game. This set of cards is called Charge to the Game. It's another black owned business. I find them on Twitter. They have a podcast, but it's just like a drinking game and you just pull cards. So let's see what we can do. Okay, name Michael Jackson songs. The first person to mess it up must moonwalk or take a shot. Oh, I got this one in the bag. I don't have this in the bag. Okay. Oh, so uh, we're going to take shots of the lovely. Crown Peach. Can I get a round of applause for the Crown Peach? Thank you. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to pour me some. In my eyeball, I guess that's a shot. Go ahead and lick it. Don't waste it. Alright. Okay. Alright, you ready? Yes. Okay, so name Michael Jackson songs. The first person to mess it up must moonwalk or take a shot. Okay. Three, two, one. Thriller. Speed Demon. Dirty Diana. <laughs> you hesitated, girl. I don't know how to moonwalk. Take a shot. It says moonwalk or take a shot. That's not fair. You want to do it again? No, I'm fine with taking the shot. There you go, alcoholic friend. Mm -hmm. I do the thing. You don't want to take the whole thing? I will. I'm a thug. One second. Oh. Mm -hmm. Amen. All right. Um, okay. 
Let's go. Since we started light, let's stay light. McBride this. sisters. Okay. It's called Black Girl Magic Rose. And this is um 13%. Mm. 18% to 13%. Okay, Rich. Take your name, take kicking ass and take your name, right? Or something. Hit me. Okay. Okay. I'm going to toast to friendship. You know, me and Brittany been friends since like carry the two. And then over and divide by. I want to say like 2007, 2008, I was like in eighth grade. And I thought she was my age, but she's just only 4'11". So, <laughs> you know, it's kind of hard to guesstimate her age. But um, we've been real cool. So what did I say I was toasting to? A friendship. Te toast. <laughs> oh. I don't know what's wrong. Okay, toast to friendship. May we stay in each other's lives. For a longer time. For a lifetime. A lifetime sounds better. Yeah. All right, here we go. Cheers. Cheers. You can stop recording. I can do without this. Without? Mm-hmm. I'm not really, even though rosé is like a beautiful color, um, don't really like the taste of it. It's an earthy taste. Um, it don't got much of a taste. Maybe it's because we went like super sweet with Earl. <laughs> Sorry, my throat's making noises. Maybe it's because we went super sweet with Earl with the mango scotto. And this, I feel like this is not as sweet and it's a little drier, right? Definitely a little drier. It's a uh, cut at the end. There's no like after. I mean, I guess that's good that there's no aftertaste, but I, I need a little more. Okay. Cause I, I don't, did you pour this? I think I did. Yeah, I did. I'm straight. Let me see, because I don't know. It tastes nutty. What kind of nut? Peanuts, walnuts, cashews. Not the other kind of nut. I don't know what that tastes like. It don't have a smell. It's not like the Earl. Let's see. It's just cutthroat. I'm not feeling it. Yeah, it don't got nothing to it. I drank that with ease. Ain't nothing to it but to do it, right? Yeah. But I love the bottle. Love the bottle. Eat a spoonful of mayonnaise or take a shot. I have mayonnaise. I love I mayonnaise. I don't do mayonnaise. That's nasty. Mayonnaise is a good. A spoonful? Mayonnaise is good. You would do that? Probably. Like, willingly. Probably. I love mayonnaise. Go ahead. <laughs> Makes it go down fine. That's a new saying. I have a feeling we're gonna get messed up tonight. That's okay. We have nothing to do tomorrow. That's very true. <laughs> woo, 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 woo. Okay. Oh, I heard that. that was a deep goal. <laughs> Until your next turn, all players must talk without closing their mouth. Okay. Every time your lips touch, you have to drink. Oh, Laura, my lips ain't touching then. So this includes me, right? Uh-huh. Okay, let's see how I can do this. So we gotta talk about the line. Yeah, so I got can you, lips oh, touching. Oh, which one you wanna do, this or this? Let's do, I'll do this one. Okay? Okay. I feel like I look crazy. I should skip that one. Let me know if my lips touch, cause I don't really know. I feel like they're right. They feel a little lazy. I feel like I'm about to start drooling. <laughs> you look like you have you ever seen in Living Color when Jamie uh, Foxx was in there? Yes. That's who you look like. Did my lips touch? Did my lips touch? Uh huh. They did. Yep. Fuck. <laughs> do I? Yeah. Three. How many times did it touch? Like three. Yeah. Three. Okay, two. Okay, yeah. Cause you gotta here. drink two shots. Oh. And we're gonna keep doing this until we drink the uh, wine. Okay, that's fine. Let me hurry up. Okay. Okay. Oh, 
Okay. I'll take the shots after we drink this. <coughs> Why did you make that face? I can just smell the dryness. You don't know that. It might it be sweet. It says a sweet red wine. You're right. It could be sweet. I hate red wine. I'm toasting to finding love someday. Oh, yeah. It's finding love because like we said, we single. Right. We're looking for a best friend and a lover second. Okay. Cheers. <laughs> I almost slapped it on the table like it was a shot. Okay. I'm scared. There's a reason why I made that face. This ain't our kind of sweet wine. For this to be, this ain't that sweet. It, it ain't, ain't sweet, sweet at all. No. It's, um, that's what I knew it. Oh, that one gives you chills down your spine. No. This one, I feel like it's a wee bit drier than the Black Girl Magic one. Because I drank that one with ease. This one was with ease too. But I really was just expecting for it to be sweet. And it just wasn't. I feel it on my cheeks. You want to open up this 19 Crimes Cali Red? It'll be my pleasure. Let's see what this is paying for. This is the last bottle. And this one kind of smells sweet. Let me read the back. I don't trust that factor. What's the percentage? 14.1. That toast to uh, success. Mm, I definitely need success. All right, y'all. Last one. Are we doing another round of charge it to the game? Yeah, we'll do another one. I'm so scared. <laughs> We're grown as fuck. You're grown as fuck. Shut okay, up. I'm do this. Okay, ready, set, go. Hell no. Hell no. No. No, Snoop. No. 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 If you like dry, drink Snoop. No. Ugh. Mm -mm. That, made, that made my tongue change in texture. That is disgusting. Oh, hell no. I'm going to drink the rest. But this is nasty. If you like dry, kudos to you. Drink Snoop. I'm not gonna drink it. My tongue feels weird. It feels like a Brillo pad. Like all the little hairs on my tongue are like going a different way. I'm gonna drink it. Um, I didn't, I didn't taste anything. I just think I'm just too far gone at this point. I don't know. <laughs> These three don't taste like anything to me. Um, this had the most flavor is what I could say. I agree. Um, 19 Crimes Cali Red. Um, I don't know if it's because we drank all of them, but I didn't taste anything. Like, it's probably like a hint of sweetness in there. A hint. Barely. Um, just, honestly, if we had to rank them as far as taste, I'm definitely going with the Earl. It had, it's sweet. Um, although it's mango and I don't like mango, it does taste the best. It's like not a strong mango flavor. Um, and then after that, I would go in the McBride Sisters because that was very easy and it wasn't very sweet either, but it was just like very plain, very easy to drink. I guess if you like that stuff, it's rosé. Um, and then... I would say the Earl Sweet Red Wine was better than the 19 Crimes Cali Red. Um, yeah, no, these were not it. I mean, maybe it's because I'm not a real wine drinker that I don't really know, but this was hitting, like it had flavor. You know, I already, I've had another bottle of this one before and I finished it with ease. Um, even for me to not even like mango, but yeah, I don't, I don't know. Brittany, what are your thoughts on the wines? <laughs> um, I like liquor. And after drinking these wines, I realized why I like liquor better. So, I would say this mango one would be better if it was chilled. Okay. I feel like I would down it, 
with no ease, like no problem, you know? All ease in drinking this, you know? I will go to this one because I do agree you can't really taste it in a weird way. This one's I, you know, Snoop is horrible. Um, very dry for my tasting. Um, yeah, I just would never want to drink any of these ever again. And I'll be fine with it. All right, y'all. Well, um, thank you for tuning in. You heard what we said about these black owned, these black wines, and <laughs> I just gotta get off. I just gotta get off the internet at this point. Like I can't. I just want to go to sleep. Listen, if y'all have any suggestions for us, anything you want us to try, anything you want us to do, let us know. Different liquors. <laughs> this is the toast to the end of the video. You got me fucked up. I almost threw up. Oh my gosh. Hell no. I'm done.